Okay, here we're going to talk about heat pumps. And now the purpose or the objective of a heat pump is to maintain a warmer area relative to the surroundings. So oftentimes used in, in housing, uh, when it's cold outside, you want to keep it warm inside. Okay. Um, now, we've talked about the Carnot heat pump cycle back in Chapter 5. You'll remember the coefficient performance is the, te the absolute temperature of the hot space. That's what you're trying to heat over the temperature difference between you know inside and outside or the hot and the cold reservoir okay so the closer those are together the better your performance or the closer the temperatures are okay now the actual heat pump we can't use the carnot and it's it literally is exactly the same thing as the refrigeration cycle just which one you're looking to do right so on a refrigerator, you're trying to keep one space cold. On a heat pump, you're trying to keep one space hot. Okay, but it is exactly the same uh, system with an evaporator, condenser, compression, compressor, and an expansion valve. Again, this time Q out is what is important to us. So the coefficient of performance is just Q out over the power input to the compressor rather than Q in uh, to the power input of the compressor. Okay, now this performance again can change based on what we talked about previously with the heat pump cycle. The closer I can get the basically hot and cold temperatures inside and outside temperatures together, the better it's going to perform, which makes sense. You know, if you um, if it's 60 degrees outside and you want it 70 inside, it's not going to have to work very hard. Okay, so what people can do is rather than pulling from the outside air, which you know, in Wisconsin can be minus 20 or something like that Fahrenheit. Instead, you pull the heat from, say, a body of water or a well or just the earth in general uh, that is above whatever the outside air temperature is, okay? And that can help with the performance of this heat pump. But again, it is the same system as the refrigerator, just we're looking at Q out rather than Q in.